afternoon Viva MK. Thank you for joining me on another live update for the business, at which point I can not only make the usual cock-ups, but at least I can tell you what's going on the business and what is coming your way. So once again, thank you for joining me. Of course, the reappearance of this suggests I might be talking about showcases today because you keep asking. So we will return to my favorite black rod later. So, but first I want to talk about products, but evolution first. In business and personally, we have to continuously evolve, which is why I've said this show must go on. Irrespective of everything or anything, you have to take into account customers and of course distributors and network marketing. For us, our customer is you. So we constantly have to evolve in this business. The show must constantly go on to give you what you need in the program and in the business. And that's why we change the marketing plan. And that's why we're changing product selections. And that's why we're doing some of the things we do. So just in case you ever wonder why things do change, they evolve. They don't change. They evolve and they adapt to help you in your business. And that's why we do things. So evolution is always, always a necessity in any business, but particularly in a business like ours that involves so many hundreds and hundreds of people. Now, the great thing about Viva MK is, and it is refreshing after being in the corporate world for so many years, and it's refreshing because when we think of something where evolution and changing and adapting is concerned, we can do it fairly quickly. There is no board of directors to get authority from. There is no reams and reams of meetings to have. Pointless discussions that always go round and round. I've done that for years. It just doesn't work. It doesn't work where you want to be effective and speedy. So sometimes when we get an idea because you've suggested it or the environment tells us so, we can implement it fairly quickly. Um, and that's co conveniently brings me on to the Viva MK Basics range. Now, the idea behind that, and I'll show you the cover in a moment, the idea behind Viva MK Basics is, is really listening to you based on what your customers are telling you. Because we don't know what your customers are saying until you tell us. So product suggestions and recommendations have been absolutely vital. And I know you've been sending us hundreds and hundreds of emails. And no, we're not going to start selling Ansomers type products. You can forget that altogether. Not for now anyway. But we listen to most of your suggestions based on your customer feedback. Which is where the basics idea came from. Viva MK Basics. More products that you customers actually want. Now, when it comes to products, you have to think of it in two ways. You either give a customer exactly what they want and what they're after, or you give them something they didn't even know they wanted. So you create a market. And there's where two product um, ideas work. Give them what they want, but also give them things they didn't know they needed. And, you know, business is very important that we constantly do that. Try and give people what they want, but also give them, an, give, give them products that they didn't know they wanted, they didn't know they needed, they see it and they buy it. It's almost like an impulse buy. And it's really important to have both. So we've got, we get a lot of sales from products that people didn't know they really wanted until they see them and then they buy them. But the basics range will hit that will will, will hit the nail on the head what where products are concerned, where people really want these things. They want the basics. So to give you an idea, this is going to be the front cover of our basics. Just to give you an idea, you know, it's bold, it's fresh, it's colorful, it has back to basics written on it, clearly only a first edition, because if that works, we will carry on doing it. And again, that's a great thing about evolution. When something works, you can do more of it. But evolution means you get the chance to try new things all of the time. So that is going to be... Um, the cover of your basics catalogue, leaflet or whatever it's going to be in a moment. I'll tell you how many products are going to be there in the first edition. But take a good look at that. The idea is to keep it bold. The idea is to suggest as bargains. The idea is to say that, that we have gone back to basics. And then, of course, the tagline, everything you need 
all of the time everyday essentials um so i'm hoping that that is again you know evolution where product selection is concerned evolution for your customers and evolution for you in making money from these kind of products so that first edition will have about a hundred products in it so it's only a first edition it will look fairly basic and clean cut like that because sometimes you don't need long ass did I really say that? You don't need long descriptions on products. Some things are really basic that, that you people know what they are. You know, you don't need a massive description for cling film. You need to know how long it is and that's about it and the price. So it's going to look straight. It's going to look clean. It's going to look basic. It's going to give you about a hundred products that customers really want. And for example, this is one of those. This is bleach tablets people have been asking these right from inception um so this is a quite big tub 200 beach tablets <laughs> yes i won't be doing any kind of demonstration where these are concerned but that's a typical um viva mk basics product 200 powerful chlorine disinfectant tablets and i know people have been asking for those you know almost from inception so that's typical of it as is the cling film you saw on the front there i don't think you'll be surprised with any of the products because they're the kind of things that everybody has at home and everybody wants therefore fulfilling that need for basics of course, the other side of the products is very similar to what we launched in Health and Beauty only a couple of weeks ago. Things that people didn't even know they wanted, but now they want them because they've seen them. We'll also be getting some of those, some samples ready for you so you can actually give samples of some of those products from Health and Beauty. Because when a customer wants to change the brand they use, for example, whether it's makeup or whether it's soap or whether it's some kind of washing um, product, they want to have a sample of it. People are very fastidious when it comes to choosing their particular product. They're very choosy. So we'll get some samples for you in, again in the coming weeks. Now, time line for this um, I'll give you the exact date next week but it's it's no matter it's no more than a couple of weeks away I said to you it would be March you'll be well within March of course I wanted it much sooner than that but you know things do take time to source to, to design and then get the products in so there's three things you always have to do design it get the products in and of course um, then get them ready to go out um, but the design team done a great job with that, as have the selection team. And as I said, you won't have any surprises with the products. They're the basics that everybody wants, that everybody needs. Bleach tablets and cling film with, with minimal descriptions because nobody needs a description of what cling film does. I know some people do odd things with cling film, but what it's meant for. Most people know what it's actually meant for. All you need is the size of it and the price. So that's the latest on products. That will continue to evolve. If this works, it's only a beginning, hence this first edition. If this works, um, we will do more of that, as well as the products that innovate. Now, a timeline, as I said, it's, um, uh, this should go to print very early next week. We could even have it next week, but don't, don't, don't hang your hat on that. I'll give you the exact dates in the email communication. Now, how do you get hold of it? Um, we'll put it free in orders, simple as that. We'll probably put 50 of each in every order and I'll give you the criteria for that. Of course, there will be an option to buy extra, but we'll put a certain quantity free into every order from when they actually come in. So all that details to follow. Today, I really wanted to just expand on what I told you. And I can categorically tell you this purely came from your recommendations and your suggestions. You see how Viva MK has now continued to evolve you know we started uh, we started back in July with a catalog that had less than 100 products in it we had 67 products and now our port portfolio continues to grow and the range continues to expand and that's always going to be the case so thank you to each and every one of you who've made that recommendation who've helped us with what's going to be in here and I do believe it's going to be a great departure for us to become the company that not only can give you give the customer exactly what they want with the brilliant service that you offer but then offer innovation and offer products they didn't know they really wanted um, 
Where the back office is concerned, I'm just changing the subject over to back office now. I've told you that we're expecting a brand new scope on back office. That again is just a matter of days away because that of course coincides with a new network marketing plan where you'll see all your genealogies in, in, in a new structure. You'll have a new ordering site. All of that is gradually coming together. I don't think there'll be much more delay on it. We are talking just for a matter of days. I know you've heard me say that before and sometimes we're at the mercy of software engineers i've never really understood that industry um but it, it's getting done and it's getting created and you you again it'll, it'll be surprisingly different to what we have now I've, we've tried to make it simpler which is of course what you've asked for we've tried to make it cleaner which of course is what you've asked for and mainly just better functionality and better usability that you know more more friendly to use so that's the idea behind that but that coincides of course with a brand new marketing plan which um is was was launched on the 1st of march so when it comes to showcases you know of course like i said to you last week you know home isn't a place it's a feeling and i guess for me personally that's the the, 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 the happiest I've been in the business so far, although every day is a happy day, as we all know, you know, there's nothing negative, everything's always got to be positive, and it, it's important to, to have that attitude, but that kind of just proved to us that it's all about people, you know, it wasn't the location, it wasn't even the business, it was the people getting together and making home, and it really felt like that friendly people connected, and I'm hoping each and every single person feeling valued and if you didn't you will do you know that and, and like I've said to you from the start the whole idea of Eva MK is not just to make money it's also to have a connection and feel a belonging somewhere and that was a great opportunity to feel that and I felt that and I hope every single person that attended felt that energy and the anticipation so many of you are, have asked, you know, are we going to have another one? Or well, what do you think? What do you think we're going to do? I would categorically say, yes, of course, we're going to have another showcase. Then you're going to ask me, well, when's it going to be? Because you do that, don't you? You constantly ask questions, especially when I leave so many loose ends, so many untied ends that you constantly want to know. So, yes, we will have another showcase. I can't give you the date today, but I'll tell you something. It will be this year. It will, without a doubt, be this year and of course we will aim to make it spectacular of course we will how can it not be spectacular with the people that we have involved in this business we have a spectacular group of people that come together and create this business that's you and all of us together so yes there will be a showcase and in the coming weeks i'll give you the date in the coming weeks, I'll give you the location. And in the coming weeks, I'll give you more information about it. But I thought I'd tell you because that's one message I truly have been inundated with. Um, people wanting to know, is there going to be another event? I think events are really important. I, I, I understand the need for technology and Zooms and those kind of digital connections. But as you notice for the people that attended, there is nothing, nothing, nothing in this world that is better than contact and seeing people face to face. It, it, it's what makes our industry. It's so important in this industry more than any other industry. You know, some people talk about automation and I know how important automation is, but this is one industry like uh, I think Debbie G said the other day and a number of you others have mentioned this that network marketing is one one industry that won't ever be automated no one would be stupid no one would be stupid enough to make a robot out of me or many of you listening now so it's never going to be automated which is why it's so important to have events so yes there will be another showcase 